I should try to stay out of sight.
You... are you... Alexios of House Ayad? I am. I am Xanthi, Magistrate of Pitana. I have a noble task befitting someone of your high station. My son is to start his military training at the Agoyi. My husband is away at war, and I have official business to attend to. Can you escort him for me? I can escort your son to the camp master. Good. He'll learn how to be a man like his father and brother, or he'll die trying. But my service needs to be rewarded. Of course. You would be paid well for your time. And they say Spartans don't speak sweetly. My youngest is a dreamer. His head is filled with boyhood stories. He must learn how to serve his nation first, and then his family. It's not an easy path. He will find glory as a true Spartan soldier, or die bravely in the attempt. There is no greater way to honor Sparta. You'll find the Agohi camp southwest of here, near the foothills of the mountains. Makarios, come here. Hello. I'm Alexios. I am honored to meet you, Eagle Banner. I can't wait to learn to fight like my brother Theoros, and to hear all your stories of deadly monsters and glorious adventures. This way, Alexios, the Agohi is up in the mountains, so we can train closer to Olympus. What's it like being a mercenary? I do what I must to get by. My brother said the same thing about being a man in Sparta. We learn to fight, to die for our family and our country. I can't wait. You love your home, huh? I do. We are strong and we are free. And any man will happily give his life for his city, his fellow soldiers, and his children. So how many children do you have? Oh, no, none. But when I'm older... and will have the strongest sons. <laughs> well then. Do you know why a Spartan soldier can lose his helmet or spear without worry? But if he loses his shield, he is punished beyond all measure. Tell me. It is because a soldier needs his helmet and spear to defend only himself. <laughs> Stay on your guard! Dearly important for the safety of his brothers and the whole battle line. Stand your ground! <laughs> Life ends, hot and messy. What of your brother? Theoros? He's the best. He's amazing to watch in the games. He's fast and strong, and he can throw the javelin and discus farther than anyone. Oh, yes. I'm faster than anyone my age, but Theoros is like Heracles himself. He sounds like a god made flesh. He's my hero. He even sings like Orpheus. Do you want to hear me sing? The mother says I sing like a harpy. No, that's okay. I'll be glad to meet him. bring you a new charge, trainer. Makarios, son of Serios. Yes, sir. I can't wait to see my brother. Quiet, boy. No questions. You'll focus on your own lessons and duties, and speak when spoken to. Yes, sir. You'll taste dirt and blood here. I'll force you to eat a thousand bitter lessons to harden you into the bronze shield your city needs. Yes, sir. Now, Mistios. You look like you've been in a few scrapes. I don't waste breath describing my exploits, or trying to scare children. 
You speak like a Spartan. Let's see if you've learned anything else. I'm no child for you to loom over. Feel no shame when you ask for mercy, old man. <laughs> Wow, what a battle! You fought like Achilles! Huh? You do fight with the strength of the gods. Now that we know you can fight, I have a serious matter to discuss. Oh? Two of my older students have gone missing. And I need someone I can trust to find them. They should know enough to take care of themselves. Yes. But the world is full of unexpected dangers, and I cannot leave my charges to investigate properly. I can look for them. Tell me what I need to know. The two students who are missing are called Akamas and Theoros. Theoros? Makarios' brother? The same. I fear I have failed the magistrate. I'll look at the comm site and see what I can find. Burned patch. Someone dropped a torch in surprise. A lost shield. That is a bad omen. Signs of battle. Body. Huh. He doesn't look much like Makarios or Xanthi. Must be the other boy. A trail. Someone ran towards the mountain heights. Could be Theoros.
found him. I should watch my step around here. You have my thanks. My gratitude, warrior. I was certain I would not see another day. What's your name? Theoros. Trainer Iatroclis will want to know what happened to you and your companion. My aide's mate, Akamas, was killed by these dogs when we saw them sneaking about in the night. And what happened to you? I fell in combat, and they dragged me here. I saw the battlefield. You ran as soon as your companion fell. A Spartan never drops his shield. Curse you! Yes, I don't want to be a soldier. I never wanted to. All I wanted was a small boat, a small life, to fish and live in peace. A fisherman? I came all this way for a coward? So what? I didn't ask for this. It was forced upon me. A boy in Spartak has no other choice. Your mother and Makarios will be disgusted by you. At least I'll be alive to pray for them and love them from afar. Thank you for my life, Mistios. But tell them I'm not coming back.
There'll be trouble if I'm spotted here. Cosmimata dinamenos fairy. Stay over there. What do you have to share with me, Nistios? Magistrate Exanthi. I have black news for you. Your older son is lost. Dead? In the face of danger, Theoros abandoned his shield and fled his duty. This is hard news, a blow upon my heart. I do not thank you for your words, but they needed to be heard. Makarios has started his training at the Agogi, and... Who knows? Maybe one day, Theoros... I have but one son now, Mistios. To other matters. There are several in the region who could benefit from your presence, Eagle Bearer. Help them, inspire them, and I'll reward you. Give me their names. The farm owner, Laniki, as well as several of the town's important women, Zita, Zamia, and Zefxo. I'll find them and see what they want of me. May the Dioscuri watch over your path. 